They say communication is key. And when it comes to leading a church or a non-profit organization, that is equally true. It is amazing how many issues can be resolved with good communication, how much further a vision can be progressed because of good communication. So as a church or charity leader, I wanna share with you five key tips for improving and strengthening the communication in your organization. So the first thing is transparency. Be transparent. Sometimes people just want to know. And of course, there's levels of details that not everybody needs to know. But be honest and be tra transparent with what's going on. If, is there issues that they could maybe help solve? What's happening? What is the vision? What is the goal? Be transparent with your congregation. That is the first thing. The next thing is to share the vision. Sometimes as leaders, we can be so busy and occupied pushing towards the goal, pushing towards it, that we don't actually realize we, have, we haven't actually shared clearly and consistently what the vision is. And so it's so important to share. What are you building towards? What is that five, 10 year plan? Where are you going as an organization? Share that with your congregation because you are rowing together. And it's amazing how quickly you can go together as opposed to pushing alone. And even if you don't think you're pushing alone, if they're not clear on the vision, there's only so much they can do to support you in the vision. So communicate the vision and not just once or twice, consistently until it becomes DNA of your organization and your members. So the next thing is collaborate. Remember, you are not alone. You may be the leader and the head of this organization, but just because you lead the vision doesn't mean it's solely your responsibility to carry the vision and carry the weight of that. So remember, you have a whole congregation of members that want to support and want to collaborate and want to aid you. We will go further together. So don't be afraid to invite uh, feedback, which is the next point, and to collaborate. So yes, invite feedback. Sometimes when we are so focused on a vision, when we're so focused on a goal, so focused on what we're doing, we can become tunnel visioned as leaders. And so actually every now and again, have a forum where you can receive feedback and we, we can, you can receive advice because there is, God speaks through us all. And although as a leader, you carry that, that mantle. Although as a leader of a charity or any nonprofit organization, you carry that mantle. It's amazing how inspired and how, how many great ideas there are among your members, among your congregates. So, it, congregates, so facilitate that and provide a forum for them to share those insights and feedback. And finally, progress updates. Celebrate your wins together. It's not just about getting towards that main goal, whether that be purchasing a building, whether that be moving. It's about the small wings, wins along the way. We want to celebrate with you. So share those wins and share those progress updates. I hope you have found that useful. And yes, just share and communicate with your congregants and your members.